Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge and we will be underway. I'm Peter Drury and this is Jim Beglin. A delight to have him on board. Thanks Peter, hello everybody. Uh, ready to see what unfolds in this one now. It's a loose ball. Tries a through ball. Now the pass. Pumps it upfield. Tries to dink it in. Well, each team knows that they're still well below standard, and it's a question of uh, which can uh, find a way out. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Goes for goal! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. I think there's always that danger that the defence can get exploited in that way. That must have served as a real wake-up call to them. Into the channel. He slid it through. A chance! And it's a goal! Perfect placement. The one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out. Never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Passes it through. Away from immediate danger. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? The ball's come loose, and the chase is on. Goes long and forward. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? And the whistle goes for half-time. It's a dressing room that needs rousing at half-time because, in truth, they've not really been at it so far. Um, if the pep talk works, we may see a very different side second half. We need to. Egypt need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution, and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. Gets his head to it! Oh, great save, real class. Oh, much more than a, than a routine save for me, and, and yet he just coped with, with room to spare. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. I timed this run brilliantly and I think he has every right to be a little annoyed with, with the passer then and I think he's letting him know right now about that. Just a little more behind it was needed. Well, no doubt someone is being given special treatment here. Well, he's the quarterback equivalent, so I'm not surprised that he's being closed down first. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. 
I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence and, and he's delivering. Seems now to be all about width. Well, when you have the personnel to create in wide areas, then they need to see as much of the ball as possible. Mohamed Salah. Who's going to make this theirs? And he's there to cut it out. Good clearance and very necessary. Egypt are not functioning with the cutting edge they need. We're seeing too much passing and not enough reward. It's time for more drive and certainly for more penetration. Pumps it forwards. The referee's given a throw. it into the area harmlessly behind spoon forward like a good ball through play for a throw and there goes the final whistle one goal set